Hi, and welcome to today's session. This is Paul Binion. I'm one of the sales engineers here at Hard Dollar. And uh, today we're going to look at how you can use filtering in your reporting to drill in on just certain sections of your project that you may want to report on. In this example, we're going to use the job status report, which I can access from my report module that I have open. And we can see under job tracking, there is the job status report that I'm selecting. As I select that, we have the typical options available in hard dollar. Typically, there's a details tab to select whatever certain options I want, um, header and footer options, and so forth. But we're going to focus in on um, a filter that I can create. You can see down below, um, I can say to select a certain section of cost items and I can either select items individually or select items using column filtering. And in this case, that's what we're going to do. In fact, we can see that I already have a filter set up. And the way that I do that, I can go over in this case to my user defined columns and we can see that I have defined a column called discipline. And if I look at all of those options, I have labeled my various cost items into these different disciplines. So if I want to see just my civil items, I select that filter. It's filtered down to just those items. And perhaps that's the report that I want to run where I'm just looking at the civil portion of my, of my uh, report for tracking purposes. So I can go ahead and run that report. We'll like, take a look at a quick print preview here and I have looks like one item that I happen to be tracking against that falls into that civil category so just that item shows up on the report and this would apply for any of the other reports such as the uh, cost breakdown detailed report and other reports of that nature that would allow me to use this filtering tool so thanks a lot we'll talk to you next time